Yo, what's up everybody, K here. We're about to dive into a world of crazy cool rides, stuff you won't believe actually exists. From flying cars to transforming city cars, this list has it all. We're talking next level engineering, innovative designs, buckle up because some of these vehicles are straight out of a sci-fi movie. Before we start, could you please like the video, share it, and subscribe to our channel? Also, hit the notification bell for more amazing content. Let's get this show on the road. This is the Colatus Gyro Motion and it's being called the world's first flying car. I know what you're thinking, we've heard that before. But this thing is actually certified to fly, at least in the Czech Republic. The range is actually pretty decent at over 350 miles on a single charge and it can apparently hit almost 125 miles per hour in the air. The catch? There's always a catch. The pilot weight limit is only 180 pounds. So if you're thinking about taking this thing for a spin, you better be ready to lay off the cheeseburgers. Still though, a flying car? That's just cool. This right here is a Yamaha Majesty. Well, kind of. It as a Yamaha Majesty at least. This thing is a perfect example of the Japanese concept of Kotawari, the relentless pursuit of perfection. And let me tell you, they spared no expense on this custom build. Just look at the level of detail, the paint job, the custom bodywork, the engine mods. This thing is absolutely insane. I don't even know what all of the modifications are, but I can tell you this, it's probably faster, louder, and way more fun to ride than a stock majesty. This is what happens when you combine passion, skill, and a whole lot of time and money. Have you ever wished your car could just shrink to fit into those impossibly tight parking spaces? Well, someone was clearly listening because the CT2 does exactly that. This little guy is a fully electric city car that can actually change its size on the go. It's got this cool mechanism that extends the wheels outward for stability on the open road, and then retracts them when you need to squeeze into a tight spot. I'm not sure how practical it would be in the real world, but you gotta admire the ingenuity. Plus, it's electric, so it's good for the environment too. I'd love to take this thing for a spin through a crowded city just to see the look on people's faces. Okay, this one is just wild. This is the Quant R and it's like someone took an ATV, a supercar, and maybe a spaceship, threw them all into a blender and hit pulse. It's got a Subaru flat engine with water methanol injection. Yeah, you heard that right, which gives it a ridiculous 600 horsepower. And with that power to weight ratio, it can probably outrun most things on the road. Top speed is somewhere around 125 miles per hour, which is nuts considering this thing looks like it's about to tackle the Dakar rally. I'm not sure what category to put this thing in, but I want one. All right, we've seen flying cars, but this is next level. This is the MC-1 Octocopter, and it's basically a giant drone that you can ride. You heard me right, you can actually fly this thing. And apparently it's not even that hard. They say the learning curve is only about 10 minutes, which is less time than it takes me to figure out most things. It has a top speed of 50 miles per hour and can stay in the air for about 15 minutes on a single charge. Imagine just hopping into this thing and soaring over traffic. No more red lights, no more rush hour. Just you, the open sky, and the sweet, sweet taste of freedom. Ever wished you could just cruise across the water in your own personal jet? Well, the jet capsule is about as close as you're gonna get without actually inventing your own hydrofoil. This thing combines the speed and agility of a boat with the comfort and luxury of a private jet. It can hit speeds of up to 40 miles per hour and has a range of over 125 miles on a single charge. Imagine commuting to work in one of these. No traffic, just the open water and the wind in your hair. Okay, maybe not the wind in your hair if you're inside the capsule, but you get the idea. Sometimes less really is more. Case in point, the Solo GT. It's a three-wheeled, fully enclosed motorcycle that's street legal just about everywhere. And get this, in some states, it's actually classified as a motorcycle. Now, I'm no lawyer, but I'm pretty sure that means cheaper insurance and registration. Plus, it just looks cool. It's got a range of over 100 miles and a top speed of around 80 miles per hour, which is plenty for zipping around town. I'd love to take this thing for a spin on some twisty back roads. All right, let's talk city cars again. This is the Xerax, and it's a tiny electric vehicle that's perfect for navigating crowded urban environments. It's small enough to fit into just about any parking space, and it's fully electric, so you can feel good about reducing your carbon footprint. 
The top model can hit a respectable 50 miles per hour and has a range of about 16 miles, which is more than enough for most city commutes. Plus, it's just adorable. I mean, look at it. It's like a little go-kart for grown-ups. If you're looking for a vehicle that's all about fun in the sun, look no further than the Zero Four Buggy. This thing is designed for cruising along the beach, tearing up the dunes, and generally just having a good time. It's got a range of over 110 miles and a top speed of around 55 miles per hour, which is plenty fast enough for some off-road shenanigans. I can just picture myself cruising down the beach in this thing, the wind in my hair, the sun on my face, with not a care in the world. You know what they say, one person's trash is another person's treasure. Or in this case, one person's old Volkswagen Beetle is another person's awesome mini bike. These things are the brainchild of designer Brent Walter, and they're made from repurposed Volkswagen Beetle fenders. That's right, those iconic curves have been given a new lease on life as stylish and functional mini bikes. They're powered by a 79 CCC engine, which is enough to carry an adult and they just look so darn cool. I love the combination of vintage style and modern functionality. You ever see a vehicle and think, man, I wish I could just drive that thing straight into the water? No, just me. Well, if you ever do have that thought, the Fibian is the answer to your prayers. This thing is amphibious, which means it can drive on land in the water. Talk about the best of both worlds. It can hit speeds of up to 28 miles per hour on the water and about two miles per hour on land, which let's be honest is probably for the best. It can seat up to 15 people and has a payload capacity of over 3,000 pounds, so you can take your whole crew and all their gear with you. Remember segways? Yeah, those two-wheeled self-balancing scooters that were all the rage a few years ago? Well, they're back, and they're better than ever. The Segway Go-Kart Pro 2 is a high-performance go-kart that's packed with features. It has a top speed of 27 miles per hour and a range of 15 miles and it can go from 0 to 20 miles per hour in just 4 seconds. But here's the really cool part. It can also be used as a controller for computer racing games. That means you can get behind the wheel of your favorite virtual race car and experience the thrill of racing from the comfort of your own home. For all you speed demons out there, this is the AC40. It's a mono-hull sailing yacht that's designed for one thing and one thing only, going fast. Really, really fast. It can reach speeds of up to 50 knots, that's over 57 miles per hour, in strong winds. To put that into perspective, that's faster than most cars on the highway. It's also incredibly agile and maneuverable, thanks to its lightweight design and advanced hydrofoils. This thing is basically a Formula One car on water. Need to transport a bunch of people in style and comfort? Look no further than the Soul Shuttle 14. This futuristic catamaran can be configured as a water taxi, a business vessel, or even a tourist boat. It can carry up to 30 passengers and three crew members. And it has a spacious and luxurious interior that's perfect for everything from business meetings to cocktail parties. Imagine cruising along the French Riviera in this thing. The sun on your face, the wind in your hair, a glass of champagne in your hand. Yeah, that's the life. This is the Vua S2 SUV, and it's built for one thing, off-road domination. This beast has a ground clearance of over 17 inches and a powerful gasoline engine that delivers 280 horsepower. It can handle just about anything you throw at it, from rocky trails to muddy swamps to snow-covered mountain passes. Plus, it has a top speed of over 93 miles per hour so you can get to your destination quickly, even if that destination is the middle of nowhere. This is the perfect vehicle for anyone who loves adventure and isn't afraid to get their hands a little dirty. So, there you have it. 15 of the most mind-blowing vehicles you probably didn't even know existed. From flying cars to shape-shifting city cars, from amphibious vehicles to off-road behemoths, this list had it all. What was your favorite vehicle? Let me know in the comments down below. And if you know of any other crazy cool vehicles that I missed, be sure to share those too. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video, share it, and subscribe to our channel. Turn on the bell for new updates.